it's the prelude dude and you know what if you if you follow me on instagram you already know the news but if you don't follow me and you're just hearing it now uh the big announcement is i'm moving to arizona i'm getting away from this crap weather it's kind of fitting that it's snowing right now uh mother nature has decided it's going to just beat us down until the day that we leave so yeah at any rate I got to get these vehicles up to snuff because the only things we're taking are the Kia and the Prelude. So I'm going to daily the Prelude for a little bit when I get down there. I know I said I wasn't going to daily it. But, you know, plans change. So that's what we're doing now. And uh, there's a little bit of work that needs to be done to both of these cars to make sure they're suitable for down there. And that's what this video is. I'm just going to show you what I'm going to do and show you the parts that I'm going to order uh, just to square them away. And then once all those come in... We'll make another video throwing them on. So, yeah, let's check it out. All right, first up, we got the dead lewd. Yeah, that's my prelude. Looks good. All right, so let's kick tire a few times. Yep, upper ball joint's bad. NASCAR tryout. You know, I, I don't think I'm fast enough. They may not take me. So, let's move on. Upper ball joint is wore out, but that is not my primary concern right now. The worst thing are these brakes, man. Look at that. Look, the pad has separated from the backing plate. That was, that. I'm sure that was the wobble I was just feeling that last. Upper ball joints, those got to wait. Uh, you know, lower ball joint is fine. There isn't really any play. The strut is crap, but that's got to wait. Only thing that's mission critical is the brakes up front. So I'm going to do that. Worry about the tie rod end when I get down there. But right now, this is all I got to worry about is the brakes. So let's move to the back and check those out. Moving to the rear, I got this pry bar and I'm going to demonstrate real quick just how bad my struts are and you're going to see, you know, a ton of movement and I'm barely even prying on the tire so I should not have that much movement but it isn't mission critical just to get the car down there. I worry about it after I'm actually in Arizona. Um, so I'm going to kick the wheel off real quick and we'll take a look at the brakes, see how those are doing. Well. Alright, ceramic pads, not too bad. They actually have a lot of life and the rotors are not chewed up. Uh, caliper is moving freely, so I'm not worried about that there. Uh, and let's just say, you know, the rest of the suspension is wore out, but it's not mission critical to get it there. The main problem is, you know, these tires, yo. These tires are all bald, you know. I got one good tire and I need to order three. So I'm probably just going to order some cheap tires just to get me by and you know we'll see where we're going next up we're looking at the kia and there really isn't a whole lot wrong with this uh the main problem is the ac doesn't work and that's going to be a problem there you can see this giant crater in the condenser that's from some metal straps that i hit in the middle of the highway uh you can see the hole it left in the bumper it cracked the you know the fascia and the splash shield underneath and took out the condenser so it doesn't hold pressure right and besides that i ordered the condenser that's coming besides that it's just front brakes you know which ain't even too bad i'll do that i got some wagner thermal quiets coming and yeah now let's check those out all right so let's talk tires uh the three tires I ordered are the thunderer mach fours it's cheapest tire I could get my size, uh, you know, hate on it, whatever, they're going to get me by. Then brake motive, they're supplying the brakes. I got some drilled and slotted rotors with some pads coming with. Uh, it'll do, you know, whatever. I'm not worried. We'll see how they do. And then condenser, I got some off-brand off Amazon. Uh, 60 bucks, dude. You can't, can't complain. Some Wagner quick stops. I got those for about 20 bucks, 21 bucks, yep. And, uh, you know, I really can't complain with that. All in all, I spent just about 300 bucks on parts. And that's going to square the two vehicles away at least good enough to drive them while we are in Arizona. So, in the meantime, uh, thank you very much for watching. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that like if you did like the video. And uh, let me know what you want to see in the comments. And follow along with the journey. Next, we got parts coming.